Gosh choppy squad, Wiley and Violet, you guys are bright and early this morning. Yeah, so are you Kirsten? I just wanted to wake up for the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. Quick question though, how can it be possible to stream it if we can't watch it on cable? There is Peacock. Maybe we can just look for it on that streaming application. In the meantime, I'll go make us some bacon and scrambled eggs for breakfast. Oh my god, is that a smoky bear balloon? Only you can prevent wildfires. That was a good smoky impression, sweetie. Thanks, honey. Would you look at that? It's the Beagle Scout Snoopy balloon to promote his upcoming project for Apple TV+. And there are the iconic kids Linus and Lucy Van Pelt and good old Charlie Brown on their usual peanuts float. Snoopy is my favorite character in the Peanuts franchise. That's Walt Donnellian. Holy crap. No freaking way. Those Toys R Us kids missed you, Jeffrey. Well, even though we've been with the Toys R Us giraffe family in several of these skits. Wink wink. It's, it's the Rutgers University, University marching, marching Scarlet, Scarlet Knights. Knights. Now that's what I'm talking about. The one football team that played against the Ohio State Bud Highs earlier this month. It's a shame I lost in that close matchup. But hey, it was all in the team spirit. Ooh, and there's a SpongeBob balloon. With Gary the snail sitting on top of SpongeBob. Although it's kind of hard to see Gary from this camera angle. LOL. Speaking of Nickelodeon material, here come the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, promoting their newest movie Mutant Mayhem. There's the iconic Disney couple, Mickey and Minnie Mouse, being that they had their 95th birthday last weekend. Well, I can see Grimace in the Hamburglar in Ronald McDonald's car, but justice for Birdie gosh darn it. Golly, if Ronald has a car and a balloon, and Jeffrey and Mickey each have their own breed float, how come we haven't had one like that? Yeah, our pizza chain is popular with the kids, so you'd think that we would be in a Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade at some point. Gee, I'm not quite sure it's right. Either that we couldn't afford to participate, or we thought that it was too risky. Who knows? However, we saw brand expanding to stuff like toy lines, a potential movie and a water park, maybe the masses parable isn't the out of the equation used yet. Chuck, Helen, didn't you two make an appearance at the Hollywood Christmas Parade back in 2016? Oh, hey, yeah, I remember that's the right. time. Man, looking back on that footage, Herbie the Love Bud was there too. Again, he wasn't even in the picture until January 2018. Jesus freaking Christ, it's Keenan Thompson and Kel Mitchell. From their own classic show, and they're riding on the Good Burger Mobile. You can find the Good Burger sequel that's now streaming on Paramount Plus by the way. Oh my god we love this one. The Sesame Street float featuring Ashley Park. A Pikachu and Eevee balloon. Pokemon is such a classic. Ooh, now here comes the grand finale of this parade. Get ready everybody. Ho ho ho. Ho ho ho. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. To one and all. And thus concludes yet another exciting installment of the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. Well that was fun to watch. I especially loved the Smokey Bear, Beagle Scout Snoopy and Pokemon Balloons. He told that the Mickey Mouse and the Imagine Mutant Ninja Turtles floats were so freaking cool. And I liked that good burger mobile. Y'all know what else I'd like. The National Dog Show and a little bit of football before turkey time. Bang! Caillou, we thought that we could introduce you all skit taster fanatics to a new friend as we end this video. This one here is another character that brings in diversity. Her name is Juana La Iguana. Hola a todos. Básicamente soy un Bernay español, pero en lugar de un dinosaurio morado, mi programa trata sobre una iguana verde. Y agradecemos a Cool Swords X123 por la idea de un novato en este grupo. If anybody is confused, she said that she's basically a Spanish Barney. But instead of a purple dinosaur, her show is about this green iguana. And shout out to Cool Swartz X123 for that idea of a newbie in this group. For the most part, no hablo inglés. With all that being said, we hope you enjoyed this belated Thanksgiving skit, and if you did, please be sure to give it a like. Share your thoughts in the comments section, and subscribe to Mason and Kirstein's channels so you won't miss any new content on the way. We'll see you next time.